this demo, we're going to go through the process of creating leader styles for our notes and also for our furniture tags. And once again, you can find the specifics in our um, IDCAD standards, but we're going to go through the, the actual process of creating those, those uh, the leader styles. It works very similarly to the dimension styles. So what we want to do is, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that my text is set to my um, uh, stylus BT 330 seconds of an inch style, whatever you've called that. Um, and then what I'm going to do is go to the annotate tab and go to this leaders area, click on the arrow in the lower right hand corner. And I'm going to start with the annotate of style that comes with AutoCAD and I am going to click on the new button. And the one that I'm going to create first is the one for the notes. So I'm going to click continue and I'm going to go through the different tabs here. We're going to leave uh, the general information here the same. So we want straight uh, leader lines. You can also set it to have splines or to have no arrows, but we'll, we'll set this for straight. We're going to leave the arrowhead as close filled, but we're going to adjust the size to 3 30 seconds of an inch. For the leader structure, I'm going to just go in here and set the landing distance to 3 16 Make sure annotative is checked, and then in content, I'm going to leave the multi-leader type as M text, but I'm going to come in here to the text style, and I'm going to use this pull down to select my stylus BT 3 30 seconds of an inch or my notes um, style, and then I'm just going to click OK, and then I'm going to create another um, another style, and we can start with our note style. That's fine. We're going to click New, and this one is going to be our furniture tag style. And uh, so I'll just hit Continue. Now, what we want to do first is we want to change this arrowhead. Instead of close filled, we're going to change this to dot small. And the leader structure will stay the same. When we get to content, though, what we want to do is change the multi leader type from M text to block. And then we want to go in here and select the circle block, and that will give us the correct format for this style. And then we're going to click OK and close. And then that's just to create the, the styles. I'm going to uh, next do a demo showing you how to apply the styles and to use the annotation feature both for text and for these leader styles.